For the first time in centuries, you don't have to be a Saudi prince to own your own sports seat. We're talking about the first ever online NFT powered sporting league, which is conveniently called NFTs. 10,000 unique sports teams that are going to battle each other every month in a March Madness style tournament. Once you own an NFT, you get access to future games and also have full commercial rights. And that pretty much means you can do anything. You can print it on a mug for all I care or even on toilet paper and sell it in the next pandemic. Now let's talk about the launch. Out of 10,000 total NFT teams that cost 0.08 ETH each, 1,100 has already been minted. Now the remaining 8,900 will be minted on the 16th of October in a really cool and neat way that will avoid gas wars. Here's how it's done. Now on the drop day, in the first hour, only OG mint pass holders are able to mint and they can mint up to 20 NF teams and these passes are going at about 3 ETH right now on the secondary market. Now here's a fun fact for you. These OG passes were actually originally given to the first 150 members that joined their Discord channel. And imagine all they had to do was click that join button early. Now in the second and third hour of the drop day, only the five team pass holders can mint. And well, they can mint up to five different teams. Now this is passes that were sold back in September for 0.05 ETH and are now going for about 0.28 on the secondary market. And after all of this, it's time for everybody else to mint the remaining teams. By the way, all the revenue received from selling these mint passes will actually go straight into the community fund rather than going into the miner's pocket, which is pretty awesome. Now let's talk about the team. Well, the man behind this project, and no, I'm not talking about his ape, I'm talking about the man himself, Steve. He's been documenting the entire journey all up on YouTube. There's even educational content for newbies that talks about how these teams are being generated or even how much money this project is going to make. Not only does this make it easier to trust a project as transparent as this, the kind of content Steve is putting out helps newbies make informed decisions. And of course, all of these are authentic financial advices, so don't be my art and listen to everything I say. I'll see you guys on the next video.